is right there, Earthquaker. Stop that evil doing. Your low calorie threats mean nothing to me. Take that, Captain Skeleton. are no match for the foul weatherman. Now, we shall take the cosmic eraser, and with it, we shall control the world! Not so fast, Dust Devil! Pajama Man! I'll spin you to the four corners of the Earth, Jupiter! My handy-dandy Pajama Man superpower back is different! Pajama Man, you say! Exactly! It's okay. It's just a little thunder and lightning. Thunder and lightning aren't so frightening. Thunder and lightning aren't so frightening. <laughs> Thunder and lightning aren't so frightening, but I'm scared. Someone's got to go upstairs and do something about this weather. This looks like a job for... Pajama Sam! I know I left my Pajama Sam cape around here somewhere. I better find it. And welcome to the game that started it all for me. Well, not necessarily the game, but the game series. The game series that started gaming for me was the Pajama Sam series by Humongo Entertainment. And I just so happened, th th like, I mean, this is the second one. I would totally be playing the first one if I could. But it just, like, I was at Goodwill earlier today and with my brother and some friends. And he pointed out. Do it in a second, Sam. <laughs> but uh, he noticed. Pull is like, whoa! Look at this! And it's like, I was like, whoa! And then I had, like instant childhood flashbacks of sitting in front of my mother's office computer, playing this game. And it's actually running at a six hundred uh, six hundred and forty by four eighty resolution, which is funny because it's kind of tiny on my screen. Ugh. But anyway, let's continue as I talk more about stuff. Better not be there. <laughs> Better not be there. No. Okay. Nope, like when I was a kid, this was like the coolest thing ever. It was like Pajama Sam and Freddy the Fish and Putt Putt. Although I didn't have as mu many Putt Putt games as I did Freddy the Fish and Pajama Sam. I had all three Pajama Sam games, and I didn't have any of the ones after them. Um, but I had uh, Freddy the Fish. I think uh, like something about a circus. There was like a circus in one. Something about like an old west town and like going to school or something like that but the the ones that stuck with me the most were the pajama sam ones and i loved them and like a well, great thing when i was a kid was they were always random like i mean like the as in the solutions for the puzzles were always random around here somewhere and i loved it also like this random things you can click on and interact the best ones that, that did that were Pajama Sam because they weren't like as like a broken looking as Putt Putt where it'd be like I click a bush and the bush turned into an orange and such. I think the ch ch drawers, they're usually there, yeah. Pajama Sam is ready for action. Now I can go upstairs and take care of all this thunder and lightning. I better get upstairs and do something about this. So I don't know how long I'm going to be recording this because, heck, the games didn't take that... <laughs> they aren't that long. They're kind of meant to entertain a child. And, like, they finish... They usually finish really quickly. Really, yeah. Hmm. That'd be a cool mirror. Just one that's a house. Ooh, both. Tree. And then a house. That's me when I was little. Okay, let's get this. <laughs> 
the weather comes from. Thunder and lightning must work there. So let's see. Click cloud. Stuff happened. I don't even know what that is. Uh, that's cool. Um, before I go down, anything else you can click? Uh, let's go down. But you may think it's like... Thunder and lightning. Pajama Sam is coming! You, you must be thinking... The, what what business do I have playing a child's game on this channel when literally the thing I recorded right before this is Dead Space? But like I said, it was my childhood, and I'm having a massive nostalgia factor happening right now, like all day because of this. And I'm glad, because I, I loved Pajama Sam when I was a kid. Hi! What do you want? I'd like to go inside, please. Are you an employee? No. Sorry, no visitors. Let's see. I've already figured this out. Oh. Look at the crowbar. It's clearly something I need to pick up. A crowbar? I bet this will come in handy. You know, and I guess, I guess this could be related to Dead Space. Dead Space, scary game. This game. This is fun. How do I access my inventory? How do I access my inventory? <laughs> That's funny. I think it's empty. I'm glad I stopped wearing that itchy mask. I wish I had a sandwich. Um. I don't know what I'm doing. Hold on, I'm gonna look in the actual, like, little booklet to find the buttons, because I can't remember the buttons, and the game doesn't actually come with a tutorial. Where is this thing? Oh, dude, look at this. Look at this. Some stickers. Of course, we're gonna cut. Excuse me? Figure it out. Should be the buttons in here. Excuse me. Excuse me? Okay, I found it. I just found out how to save, so I'm gonna I'm gonna just do a save the uh, save and load to do a test of the saving system, see where it's what's gonna happen. S. Oh yeah, you put it there and type it. He's too big of a character for it to fit. Let's go with that. Done. Saved. Everything's hoopty dandy. Let's get these items. Use this on that. Oh, my God. 
What is this? Let me go grab everything. Oh, I missed these sound Worldwide effects. Worldwide weather employee identification card. Foster boondoggle. Do not lose this card. Maybe there's a lost and found somewhere where I can turn this in. But until then, I'm gonna keep using it for my own nefarious deeds. Let's um, let's go here. Let's go closest, closest to the pajama to Sam. Welcome to Worldwide Weather, sir. Thank you. Welcome to the Worldwide Weather Automated Response System. If you know the extension you wish to reach, you may dial it at any time. Four, eight, six, seven. I'm terribly sorry, but that is not a valid extension. <laughs> eight, six, Please seven, five, check three, the oh, number nine. and try again. Okay, let's try a different. Let's try other things. <laughs> I'm not gonna go in there just yet. The key card door. Let's go to every available place that I can get to without restriction. And that's a that's a crank. It's a hey, hand I don't crank. think this belongs here. I'd better hang on to it until I can figure out where it goes. Also, here's a puzzle piece. I think you actually need to get puzzle hey, pieces. A puzzle piece. I should pick those up. Yeah, you need the. I think you need them for uh, something. Mm -hmm. Guy. I'm Pajama Sam. I come to put a stop to all this thunder and lightning. Thunder and lightning? They'd be in the master control room. It's back the way you came. Oh, thanks. You're welcome. Let's see. Uh, what's up Do here? you have an appointment, sir? No. I can't let you back there without an appointment. <laughs> How about like, it's like I must always do the just, I must always do justice. But at a timely manner, Hello and that's convenient again, to everyone. Sir. I had to mute my mic because stuff was happening in my room. But, uh, okay, I guess the only way we can go now is a uh, keycard door. Welcome Shut up! Worldwide yeah, there we go. Escape button helps. What is this action he is? Just Joe. Uh oh, I think it ate the card. I hope it wasn't too important. Let's go in. Let's meet these people. Thunder! Thunder! There's someone in here! Call security! Oh, calm down, would you, dear? It's just a little boy. I'm Pajama Sam! I've come to put a stop to this thunderstorming business. Oh, yeah. I think we've really outdone ourselves this time. Isn't it wonderful? Uh, well, actually... I do enjoy a good storm. And it will be so helpful for the plants and things. I never... Yeah! 